sights again, whoa Some niggas bitter with life and they hate me They wanna put knife in my ribs, whoa Way this shit set up, I live like Ronaldo But I never been to Madrid, whoa She said that she working, I told her come over And we could get right at the crib, whoa Hey yo, what is good, family? Welcome back to Astro Nori for another video. So today we're gonna be talking about the full drop list for week nine, and honestly, bro, this is by far one of the best weeks that we've came upon in this season, bro. There's a lot of heat dropping. Now, the prices are super high this week, but that doesn't mean that it's not heat, you feel me? So I do wanna go ahead and talk about that today. We have the North Face collab dropping, the inflatable chair, the Playboy tee. There's just, there's a lot of heat. The S logo sets are dropping this week. There's just too much fire this week to handle. And I do want to cover it for you guys. So if you guys do end up enjoying, go ahead and leave a like on the video. Subscribe down below. Click that Gleam link. I'll be giving away a $50 PayPal credit. So I'll basically just transfer you $50 after the giveaway is done. I'm also going to be shipping off the stickers today. I might record a clip of that. I honestly don't want to do it because I don't want to show like my surroundings and shit. I might just do it for you guys. But anyways, if you guys do end up enjoying, like I said before, click the gleam link and go ahead and subscribe to the channel i do plan on having a lot of new content on the way i'm actually editing some other videos that i will be dropping hopefully tomorrow or on friday but without any further ado man let's get straight into this video <sighs> Alright, so you guys are obviously not gonna know this, but I just took like a probably like an hour break and in that meantime The prices for the items came out and bro, this chair is expensive as hell This shit is like 300 bucks officially the shoulder bag for TNF is gonna be like 118 Which is kind of what I expected, but let's get straight to it Like I said before so the most hyped item is definitely that shoulder bag personally I am gonna try to go for this I was gonna go for the inflatable chair, but that price tag mm, that shit might be a brick just because of the price tag I personally feel like that shit is taxed for no damn reason bro that shit is expensive for no reason at all like i don't know bro the chair is dope but it's not dope enough to spend 300 on it i feel like some of these dope ass accessories are getting taxed on for no like no apparent reason bro it's not an actual chair it's like a floaty like an inflatable chair bro no 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 they bugging on that but that's gonna come in two colorways that orange and that white one the white one is super clean that shit is gonna get dusty it's Personally, I'm gonna go for that shoulder bag. Hopefully, I don't know what color I'm gonna go for it. And that black one is super clean for the on body, but that red is clean for resale. That might be the one that I end up with, honestly. I do like that green and purple as well. Green and purple, got me going in circles. What song is that from? Let me know. But we do got the parkas dropping this week. I'm gonna speed run through the TNF parts because I feel like I already did this. But yeah, the parka you already know is gonna have resale, and I already estimated it to be like 1k. The shit is gonna be 1.1k which is steep like that's too steep too steep to even gamble my money on this piece i'm gonna smooth leave that shit right there for big baller brand i'm not gonna get that shit myself i do not know how to say this shit but it's the novel the novu Bro, we got the logo T. This shit is actually pretty hard. Now, I wonder if the shit is embroidered, because if it is, that shit would definitely be hard. It does look like to be embroidered. I personally do like this piece. The whole gold and silver type shit is not bad at all. The colors on these pieces are actually pretty cool. That green colorway is hidden, in my opinion. It looks like a foresty green, which is a theme in this whole season. I do like that shirt, like I said before, and it is one of the more hyped pieces. Everything that I mentioned so far is some of the most hyped pieces, and I do feel like most of these will have resale except that chair that chair will most likely brick that's just my very own opinion on that we already spoke about the waste bag and like i predicted it is gonna be around 200 dollars but this waste bag is actually hard bro it gives me like that vintage supreme waste bag feel if i find pictures of old supreme bags i'm gonna put them right here but it does have that feel after that we do got the reversible puffy jacket this shit is hard bro it's like a vintage tommy type feeling on this one and i feel like the price is just right that one 98 price point for a reversible jacket that's actually really hard like i really do like this piece i know people are gonna hype up the gucci colorway or whatever but on this one i would definitely say that new york giants colorway that navy on red that official tommy bahama tommy mama looking ass jacket is definitely going to be the winner especially with that white on the inside you could definitely not go wrong with this one especially for that price bro we got the s logo set this week there's literally so much heat coming out bro the s logo set is by far it's probably one of my favorite pieces dropping this week honestly i do love s logos and have none of them i have no s logos but i do like them and honestly i wish that i was able to go for this but i am trying to go for resale so that shoulder bag has to get flipped so i don't 
don't know how I'm gonna debate. I might be able to cop this and the shoulder bag. I don't know yet. We're gonna find out. We're gonna see what it's looking like after that. The S logo is gonna drop for 168. As far as the hoodie goes, the sweatpants are gonna drop for 158, and obviously they're gonna be matching sets. So I'm gonna just talk about both of them right now. I feel like the whole set is clean. I don't know about wearing both of them at the same time. I'm not that type of person. But you could definitely pull it off, in my opinion. But I'm not gonna pull it off because that's like 300 beans, and I'm not trying to do that. But we do got the Supreme Playboy T. This is another banger, in my opinion. I do like Supreme Playboy, but not when they do all these fuck ass jerseys or these soccer shits. This T is hard. Like it has a simple Playboy logo right here. Has Supreme branding on a sleeve. It's pretty clean. Got two hearts on the sides of the Playboy, and it's just it's perfect. It's nothing over the top, but it's nothing under the bottom. You feel me? Like it's right in between. It's just perfect. And the colorways on this, once again, holy shit, are pretty cool. I would personally go for the black. You already know what it is, but that blue colorway is pretty cool. And that burgundy color as well. Those are actually hitters in my opinion. Now, if that white colorway was like a creamish neutral color, that shit would be a banger, bro. Trust me. But it isn't. And this piece is going to drop for $78 which normally I would complain about, but 78, it's Playboy, it's better quality, it has pretty good branding, it's not bad at all. After that, we got the trash ass North Face cap. That shit is ass, bro. If you get that shit, just keep it to yourself. That shit is ass cheeks, bro. We got the Menace hooded sweatshirt. I feel like they've dropped something Menace before, or this piece was supposed to drop last season. I don't even know. I feel like I've seen this piece somewhere before. I don't know. This shit is definitely not for me, so I'm gonna go ahead and skip on it. We do have the new era arc logo beanie that shit is ass like come on bro we've seen better beanies than this and now we're getting to the straight butt cheeks pieces like we do not need these this shadow plaid flannel shirt looks like you could find that shit at marshall's and i wouldn't even pick it up there for like ten dollars so i definitely am not paying 120 for this bitch it's staying right there we do got the velvet camp cap yo i feel like they've been doing too much with the camp caps bro they got polar tech they got the silky shits they got velvet drop regular camp caps for these people bro i don't cop camp caps anyways but but I'm sure as hell wouldn't cop no velvet shit or no silky shit or no polar tech shit. Just drop some regular stuff like I don't know. I'm gonna leave that right there. We do have the Rose Jacquard beanie. No. And we got the Salome set. The Salome set is a brick. Like that shit is a straight cinder block. I don't think you want that. I personally don't even want to look at it. Shit is ass. It doesn't even look like it's supposed to be Supreme. It looks like a Supreme Payless collab low key, but that pretty much does it for the whole drop list. I didn't really want to spend too much time because I would have to edit this bitch to like 12 midnight and I'm not trying to do all that. So I just try to condense this video a little bit not make it too long, you feel me? Hopefully it still was entertaining for you guys. I'm out here not trying to spend a whole day doing this shit, but that's all besides the point. If you did enjoy this video, leave a like down below. I do feel like this week is a heater. That's just my own opinion. I feel like there's a lot of bangers and if that chair wouldn't have had the $300 price point we would have been trying to go for that but i'm laughing at that retail so i'm not nowhere near that shit like i'm smooth on a do not enter side of the street when it comes to that not going towards that shit but i am gonna try and scoop up a shoulder bag or maybe that playboy t hopefully an s logo we just gonna try to make some shit happen but if you guys did enjoy leave that like subscribe if you're new click that gleam link for a 50 dollar paypal transfer giveaway type shit but yeah i guess i'll catch you guys on the next one peace Stay up and I'm out. And yeah, I got some new shit on the way. I got some cool shit on the way. Some real fresh shit on the way. So stay tuned, people. Strikes again, well, some niggas bitter with life and they hate me. They want to put knife in my ribs. Well, wait, it's just set up. I live like Ronaldo, but I never been in Madrid. Well, she said that she working. I told her come over and we could get right at the crib. Well,